What's up? Hello, Americana Highways. Whiskey sour, happy hour. And look, I've even got the swag for the occasion. I'm Heidi Newfield, and I'm going to be your host for the next 30 minutes. And uh, very happily so. Very happy to be here at the uh, hideaway. Uh, this is basically our uh, home studio here in Nashville, Tennessee. It's been a beautiful day today here in Nashville. Hope it's been beautiful wherever you are. And uh, we're excited about having you join us. And can't wait to see your comments start coming through where we can uh, kind of communicate with you and uh, maybe take some requests and so forth. Um, I'm excited about these shows. Uh, my friend Melissa Clark, who uh, started Americana Highways, um, very cool chick, and I'm, I'm super excited about spending some time around her uh, when all of this kind of opens up and we get to see each other, all of us get to hang out a little bit more. Um, I don't know if you can see this little nugget of love right here, but this is Augustus McCorgie. Gus, can you lift your little lazy head and say hi to the nice people? This is Gus. Gussy Poo. He's named after uh, the legendary Robert Duvall character in Lonesome Dove, which is one of my favorite books, uh, Larry McMurtry books, and uh, one of my favorite movies of all time. And once we uh, spent a little time around this little guy when he was a puppy, we went, oh, he's a, he's a Gus. He's an Augustus. Um, he's, he's quite the cartoon. So he's with us all the time. Let me make room. For my other compadre here, my partner in crime, Matt King, Americana hey, Americana guru also, and also... <laughs> I don't know about being a guru on anything. Well, I got to tell you all, before we break into song, this guy right here deserves a big happy hour cheers. Take a deep breath. <sighs> he has been busting his arse uh, all day. Um... You'd be surprised how, how trying to be um, a, a little high-tech with regards to um, our, uh, we, you know, we want to come across as clear as possible. We want things to look really cool. We've got some, some these are all real antiques that are either Matt's family's or my family's. And, um, <laughs> be right back. You keep talking. Yeah, so we've got, you know, we've got a, we've got a lot going on. And um, uh, he has been working his butt off getting all of this stuff together and literally tuned his guitar just a second ago, and uh, he goes, I haven't really even had a chance to um, play a dang thing. So we're going to play songs that we know, which is always good to hear, right? You want to hear songs that we know. Um, Matt, if you can move their comments over just a little tiny bit, I'll be able to read them. How much talking do we give you tonight? I don't know what that means. Not much. We're going to get right into it. We just want to make sure we're getting the technological part out of the way so I can see who's all on here. Just a little bit over there there to towards the picture. You see it nice and clear on that screen, but over here on this monitor. There you go. That'll work. That'll work. Hi, Viola. Hi, Melissa. There you go. That's fantastic. Melissa Clark. She says, hi, Gus. Gus says, hi, Melissa. <laughs> He's famous, what can we say? Um, all right, Viola says cheers to the tech. So here's, here's for that, here's to you for that. It's a whiskey sour happy hour, folks. I can't tell you what I may or may not have in this coffee cup. <laughs> I've got coffee in my <clears throat> Um, How many Lucinda Williams fans do we have tonight? Sitting there. Click on there if you are. I love Lucinda. Me and Matt both do. Um, nobody. I, I love people that are completely one of a kind, and Lucinda is one of a kind. She's a stylist in every way, shape, and form. And Gus is feeling frothy right now. He's all excited. You, you can't, you, you're going to have to shut up. You can't be all. Oh. Um, so, Lucinda did a Grammy Award-winning record called Car Wheels on a Gravel Road with, uh, with our mutual friend, Ray Kennedy. And um, back in 2008, I was cutting a record with uh, the legendary Tony Brown here in Nashville, and I was cutting my first solo record after coming out of the band Trick Pony. And uh, hi from Chicago, Jesse Ramirez, good to see you. 
Um, and so I was cutting this record, and Tony Brown comes to the table, and he says, you know, I have been waiting for a voice like yours to come along and do a cover of Can't Let Go of Lucinda's What Do You Think? And we listened in the office to it again and just refreshed our memory, and it was a no-brainer. We made the decision. The decision was made in three minutes. So, um, Dale just said, sing for us, baby girl. Well, Dale, okay, that baby girl, I'll take it. All right. Uh, Gordon Flood, hello. Pour me, please. Well, by God, we might be able to do that one for you, Alan. Uh, Rachel Russ, how you doing, Heidi? It's good to see you, Rachel. We met you in Dixon and Des Moines, Iowa. Mi love, love the Iowans. We, uh, we miss touring, y'all. We miss coming out and seeing you. So speaking of which, <clears throat> we'll play some music because we only have a 30-minute set. And by God, that goes by real quick. So I'm going to do, we are going to do this Lucinda tune that was on the, if you look up uh, the What Am I Waiting For record, you'll hear my version of this tune. And uh, Matt, what do you say we just rip on into it? Take your time. One more time, don't make me sit all alone and cry. When it's over, I know it, but I can't let go. I'm like a fish out of water, cat in a tree. You don't even want to talk to me. When it's over, I know it, but I can't let go. I won't take me by when I come around. Says he saw him and he puts me out. I got a big chain around my neck and I'm broken down like a train wreck when it's over. I know it, but I can't let go. I see I got a candle and it burns so bright in my window every night. Well, it's over. I know it, but I can't let go. You don't want to see me standing around. Feel like I've been shot and didn't fall down. Well, it's over. I know it, but I can't let go. He won't take me back when I come around. Can't hear you. Can y'all hear us? Yes. Some of you can. Here you go. Well, turn off trouble like you turn off a light. Went off and left me and it just ain't right. Well, it's over. I know it, but I can't let go. Round every corner, something I see it brings me right back to how it used to be. Well, it's over. I know it, but I can't let go. I know it, 
but I can't let go. But it's over. I know it. But I can't let go. <laughs> I love that song. I love Lucinda. All right, can everybody, everybody says they can hear. Oh, that's great. What's going on? What's happening? Gary Gilmore, you can hear. I'm so glad. Don Balcom, I can. Raul, Raul says, uh, sounds great. Well, thank you, Raul. Sue Bricker, how are you, girl? Oh, man, I can't wait to see you guys at a show. We want shows. We miss them. Um, you know what we're going to do? Let's do, <clears throat> let's do a John Prine song. Okay. I'm sorry that this is in your, probably in your way here. <clears throat> it's going to require, it's a little duet action. So, uh, this is a song that John Prine wrote for Billy Bob Thornton as a soundtrack, part of a soundtrack for a movie called Daddy and Them. This was back in the mid-90s, and it became a pretty famous John Prine song. John Prine also, tidbit of information here, also acted as, uh, he w was uh, Billy Bob's, was he was older, the younger brother, little brother? He was his brother in uh, oh, Daddy and Them. Our stream, our stream. Has our stream gone away? Hmm, hold on, guys. Hang with me. Since you got me to this for a second. Melissa Clark, find that thing. Are you still there, Melissa? Can you uh, write in and tell us? Oh, there we are. We're still streaming. That's us. Okay, so at least we're still on. Mm -hmm. Your your comments stopped, but that doesn't mean we have to. It says we're live. So. Back up and running. Okay. It says we're back up. We By God, it, but, uh, it's fine on your end. Okay, working. Matt Smith says, "Thank you, Matt Smith." Sometimes on our end, when we're this far apart, we need your input. So much appreciated. Anyway, Bill, uh, John Prine acted uh, in the movie. Andy Griffith was the father. Laura Dern was. Ern uh, Ern what, Ernest, Ernest goes to camp. What was his name? Ernest T. Bass. No, Ernest goes to camp. And Ernest T. Bass. Ernest T. Bass was from... Oh, sorry. Anyway. Sorry. I forgot. I'm thinking Andy Griffith. Okay. So, anyway, there, there's a star-studded cast, and John Prine played uh, Billy Bob's brother, and he has is just chock full of great lines in this movie. Check out Daddy and Them while you're quarantining, if you happen to be... Um, uh, since you've got some time on your hands, and uh, you will laugh, because no family is without some... Uh, wackadoo nuts in, in there. I, I know I've got some in mind. I won't say who they are, but uh, we all have them. Uh, I, don't, I don't think... Well, <laughs> okay, I'm going to have to ask somebody I know in particular. We're, we're about a minute behind. We don't audio shows us. I'm just going to assume that we're going, guys. Because we don't until, we, until we hear from you that you can't see us, we see your, we're, we're seeing, oh, hi, Dina. Nice shirt, right? Dina got me. Dina and Ari got me this shirt. So we're not seeing ourselves over here. So hopefully you can. Yeah? Gets it on like an Easter. Woo! She's my baby. I'm her honey. Never gonna let her go. Well, he ain't got laid in a month of Sunday. Caught him once and he was sniffing my undies. He ain't too sharp, but he gets things done. Drinks his beer like it's oxygen. He's my baby. He's my honey. 
never gonna let him go In spite of ourselves We'll end up dancing on a rainbow Against all odds Honey, we're the big door prize Oh, we're gonna spy Our nose is right off of our faces It won't be nothing but a big old heart Dancing in our eyes She likes catch on trampolines. Swears like a sailor when she shaves her legs. True again. She takes a lick, keeps on ticking. I'm never gonna let her go. Well, he's got more balls than a big brass monkey. A whacked down weirdo and a love young junkie. Sly as a fox, crazy as a loon. Payday comes and he's a howling at the moon. But he's my baby, I don't mean maybe. I'm never gonna let him go. But in spite of ourselves, we'll end up dancing on the rainbow. Against all odds, honey, we're the big door prize. Oh, we're gonna spy while our nose is right off of our faces. It won't be nothing but a big old heart dancing in our eyes. It won't be nothing but a big old heart dancing in our eyes. In spite of ourselves. <laughs> God bless you, John Garner. R.I.P., brother. Oh, man. I love that song so much. I, I don't get to say that in songs very often. No, you know? No. I'm sorry. I'm looking at our it just makes me stream happy. to see if we're still running here. Prime. Yes, yeah, we brother. must be then. Okay. We can't see ourselves over here, so we don't, we don't know, but it looks know like we're still running. It looks like you guys are um, uh, you guys are seeing this. So as long as you are, that is good for us. So um, I'll tell you what. We're going to do a tune right now that is on. You guys have been hearing me talk about um, a record that I am beyond excited about. It's my, this is called Americana Highways, and by God, I've made an Americana record. And uh, it's chock full of 14 songs, everything from... Um, Bakersfield to the blues. Yeah, it is. It's it's really really a cool record, and it is called the Barfly Sessions Volume One. Um, and so I want to do a, a couple songs off that record. If uh, Matt will help me out on this, I'm gonna play uh, play harp on this. So I'm gonna set this guy down. What are we doing? Um, let's do Love Block. Oh. And I'm gonna say a little prayer first. Cross myself okay. because uh, last time we did this song, I. I I, I went blank on a couple of lines, but I hadn't done it in a good while. Um, so uh, I have, I fe I'm feeling pretty good about this one. Uh, Dina and Ari, are you noticing the Switzerland Cup? I was in Switzerland, uh, Matt and I and, and my band and crew, we were in Switzerland uh, this past year. <sighs> Look forward to traveling again, don't y'all? Um, anyway... I've got a little of Bob Dylan's Heaven's Door whiskey in here. It's not a whiskey sour, but uh, because I believe good whiskey should just be left alone and sipped on. <laughs> but hey, however you take it, that's what makes the world go round. So here's to y'all. Thank you for joining us tonight. Thank you, Melissa, for having me back. And uh, we're going to do a little tune on this uh Yeah, this is a tune that I have. It's called Love Blind. They say love, well, love is kind. Well, they must be talking about some other love and not mine. I found love, was supposed to forgive. I'm gonna hold this against you, baby, as long as I live. You ain't never had no time to sell. I had to find somebody else. The wind blew a good thing to hell. I didn't wanna, so I didn't see it coming. Love blind, look the other way. Love blind, every word you say was a, a dirty lie that I believe so shame.
pretty boy Bound to stray Like a tomcat working his way down an alleyway I know you couldn't keep your hands to yourself I had to try somebody else You went and blew a good thing to hell Well, I didn't want to, so I didn't see it coming Love blind, look the other way Love blind, every word you say was a dirty lie And I believe so shame on me Well, I never thought I was this just flat out dirty and fun. Whew! Makes me thirsty. <sighs> what y'all think? You like that? My favorite, Heidi. You rock girl. Cheers to that. Cheers to you. Trisha, Gary Gilmore, awesome. Thank you. I'm glad you guys can hear this stuff now. We go, we're back. We're back where we can see what's going on. So, um, oh my gosh. Um, Let's see. I think it would be really fun. By the way, that uh, record is. Um, oh. The Barfly, Barfly Sessions. He's so good. I, I it think it's. Be coming out. See that? <laughs> wah, 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 wah. It'll be coming out in August. That is what the record looks like. And that's one of the songs off of it. And that is one of the songs off of it. My Ken, good job, man. You got illu you got <laughs> illustrations on there. I'm getting this this. You're getting this down. <laughs> That is awesome. It's always good for you guys to see what the record looks like. So, um, and of course, we will have vinyl, and we will have um, CDs for those of you who still like CDs. I know I like to have my hands on the real thing. So, um, I, I personally think it's good to have all of the above. I like to download it so I can listen to it in the car. I like the CDs so I can listen to that in the car, and then I like the vinyl so I can put it on the turntable. So I'm just—I mean, I'm not saying. But I'm just saying, if I were saying, I would get all three. Um, but those will be up for pre-sale on a brand new website, which is coming here in just about a week and a half. We should have our website up and going, uh, new one up and going. But right now you can get on HeidiNewfield.com. And, um, of course, I'm on Instagram as well. And um, Oh, look at him go. Look. Look at that. Look. Aha! You want to get on get on my Insta and follow me cuz you know what it's 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 really a lot of fun. I like Instagram a lot of uh, a lot of times cuz it's a little different than Facebook. Yeah, yeah. A lot of artisans. I follow a lot of um I'm into photographers and cowboys and uh equine stuff, anything to do with horses. I'm a happy girl, ranching and farming. Um keep up with my with my friends on both of these formats. So, um, but right now, we're just glad you're right here on Facebook Live with us on Americana Highways. And uh, it is, in fact, 
Happy hour. Whiskey sour happy hour is what they're calling this. Which fits me rather well. <laughs> so and speaking of which. I wonder who I could fall for you. I wonder who I could fall for you? Yeah. You know, that guy that guy just asked for a little happy hour moment. We got it. We got uh, we got it right here. Okay. All right. Let me get the right heart. And uh, <clears throat> so you know how I said Bakersfield's on this record. So we're going to go there right now. Um, all you Americana nuts like I am and Matt is too. You guys know who Jim Lauderdale is. He's like he's like the king of Americana. Him and Buddy Miller and um, there's kind of a group of those guys. John Prime was part of that, that too. Um, Jim Lauderdale is just the king of cool though. And he came in and sang with me on this next uh, song. And then uh, anybody who follows Marty Stewart and the fabulous superlatives, yep. well, Kenny Vaughn came over right here at the Hideaway, as a matter of fact, yep. and uh, played some fabulous Telecaster B bender on this thing, and it was groovy. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna do that for you right now and take you to Bakersfield, mm -hmm. take you back to some George Jonesy, Merle Haggard slash Buck Owensy. 19 circa 1960s ish except right now one two three hey. four. <laughs> From a tree, like a baby to its knees, like a little bitty raindrop falling from a big blue sky. If I wanted to, baby, I could fall for you. Like a seven come eleven, the devil out of heaven, the eight ball falling in the corner pocket feels so right. If I wanted to, baby, I could fall for you. Now I'm a lean in your direction. I'm thinking on it hard. I'm holding back affection till I decide to give you my heart. Like a tear on a bridesmaid stalks on a Monday sun going down when the moon's coming up at night. Oh, if I wanted to, baby, I could fall for you. I probably talked about that solo no situation excuse, no, excuse. no i i i think i jumped in and i'm i'm not sure if i didn't know if you were going to play one or not well i was always told just when in when in uh when in doubt just sing <laughs> let's see what we got sue bricker you two sound awesome thanks sue he's kind of awesome he kind of is and also for those of you um who are watching tonight uh this guy right here just got back on facebook he kind of he had kind of taken a, l a little break. Two years. <laughs> That's funny. It just. I think we're. I think we're done. It just won't go it's 30 up. Thirty minutes. Um, 
so he had taken a little break kind of what Facebook you know and so he he just started back on his music page so for all of you f you fans out there and friends who want to see this guy and get to know him and get to know some of his really really badassery uh, and and great music um, check out Matt King uh, his music page is right there on Facebook I've got one on Facebook it's you got a, a personal page too Matt, right it's Matt King music music Matt King I think on Facebook, and then MattKing.com is easy. Okay, It's got there you stuff go. from back in the old days. I was making country records, and then the stuff I did um, during the dark days. So enjoy it. Find yeah. It. I'm back on, slowly making my way back into the yeah. digital world, so we'll see what happens. I'm going to do some live stuff this weekend. Oh, that's cool. It's, it's very cool. It's a little cool. hard to hear you, Mary. Thank you. Okay. Mary so, Pedretti, hey, my SoCal girl. We'll get in a little closer. To uh, it's a little hard to. Okay, th thank you for thank you for the feedback. We appreciate that. Elaine, glad to have you back, Matt. We couldn't agree more with you, Elaine. Um, I don't know how long. How long? I think we're gonna do one more because this is a thirty-minute set, and um, we don't want to. Uh, uh, Matt Viola says badassery is right. Matt's last name question mark King. K I N G. Kang. Kang. It depends on where you come from, but yeah, Matt King. Nice and easy. I call him one word. I just, I just Thank scream you. from the other room. Matt King. Matt King. <laughs> so, uh, what do you want to finish out with? Your call, man. Uh, I think it'd be kind of cool to do a little. Let's see. What do you guys want to hear? You all sound great. Thank keep, you. I keep hearing, hearing the usual suspects. I can I know. Um, me too. So. Um, you know what we should do? What can we do? We should do some John Hyatt. Wanna? Or? No. Oh. Or do you want to do Poor Me? What key would you do it in? I can try it. I do it in uh, E. I believe. I don't. If you don't feel comfy, just you just let me know. Just totally well, we'll, put him we'll on practice the. Practice it right here. We'll just pra practice it for you guys. Is that okay? Dwayne Dean says hard to hear you guys when you talk. Um, thank you for letting us know. We'll try to get back up in the microphones. Um, let me get this. I'm a huge John Hyatt fan. Matt King used to open for John Hyatt. So here's a John Hyatt tune to close it out. But now I never went to college, babe. I did not have the luck. Stole out of California in the back of a pickup truck. With no education higher than the deeds of my hometown. I went looking for a fire just to burn it all down. You got a real fine love. You got a real fine love. Yeah. Oh, I am unworthy of. Yeah, I thought I had a line on something Maybe no one else could say They couldn't find it in their hearts To just get out of my way Then out of nowhere and from nothing Well, you came into my life Seen an angel or two before But he never asked her to be his wife You got, got a real fine love yeah. You got a real fine love One I am All your teardrops across the evening sky But you cannot hide the twinkle of the starlight in your eyes Well, I left my map way back there, baby I don't know where we are But I'm gonna pull my pony up And hitch my wagon to the star You got a real fine love You got a real fine love But I am unworthy
her all sleeping And the twilight's giving in She looks like you, he looks like me And we all look like him Well, maybe we're just a little things The way I feel tonight A little joy, a little love And a whole lot of life You got a real fine love You got a real fine love One I am unworthy Thank you for letting me host you for a little while. This is Matt King and Augustus McCorgie down there. And uh, Melissa, thank you for having us back. Thank all of you for joining us again. Um, we'll get to the rest of Europe. If I get to come back and be a guest on here, I will definitely get to do, I'll do Johnny and June for you, Elena. And um, and get some of your other uh, requests as well. We'll get to poor me as well. 30 minutes goes by mighty quick. So we're going to be respectful and sign off for now. But God bless all of you. Everybody be safe out there. And uh, I can't go away without saying thank you to all the first, uh, the folks that are on the front lines, all of you, your doctors, your nurses, your ENTs, your police, your firemen, your delivery folks of all kinds. Thank you guys for making our lives a little easier through uh, this difficult time. I don't mean to interrupt you. Is Melissa the boss? Melissa's the boss. One more. Oh, well, well, if Melissa says one more, <laughs> then by God, let's do one more. Thanks, Melissa. I like the uh, creative freedom here. That's, that 30 minutes goes by mighty quick. Um, let's see. It's kind of fun to do this because uh, you kind of get to, um, would you rather do when, heaven, which I'm giving Matt the, because he's he's gonna play main guitar on lead guitar on things. Would you rather do bring this house down? Would you rather do when heaven falls? Bring this house. We'll We're gonna that. keep it up. We'll We're gonna keep your we'll spirits up. Falls, uh, this weekend. Yeah, yeah. We'll do. A, there's also I don't think Melissa would mind if I if I plug uh, my show is on uh, Sundays. It will be this Sunday at six o'clock Central Time right here at the Hideaway. And uh, we do, we try to keep it at about an hour, but it usually ends up being a little over that. <laughs> um, and we do, do take your requests, and we've got some new cool things lined up for that as well. So, um, again, thank you so cool, so much. Uh, Raul said, this is so unique, and, and that means a lot. That's a big compliment. I, I, I think it is anyways. In a world where a lot of things are the same, it's good to be unique. Um, Pat Ford's uh, Summerlot says, love the new music. Thank you so much. I'm so excited for this record. The next song we're going to do is off of this record, the Butterfly Session. That record right <laughs> there. I had to learn like a weatherman where to point to that record. That's the Butterfly Sessions Volume 1, and this is off of that. Let's get to AD Harp. This is a super cool tune, y'all. We're going to keep the spirits high. This is kind of a funky soul kind of little feety kind of feel sympathy for the devil stonesy kind of thing meets Heidi Newfield this is called bring this house down yeah bones how about a date night in the middle of the day baby bring it on home the invasion of your love it's got me all riled up so let's get off by getting it on baby all night long oh we're gonna bring a 
this house down. We're gonna blow the roof right off this joint. We're gonna rock it to the ground. It's gonna get wild. It's gonna get loud. They're gonna be a pile of bricks and wood and stone. They're gonna have to pull us out. Yeah, we're gonna bring this house down. Oh, we're gonna bring this house down. Now if we make it to the morning And we can even find the door We'll take the only key we got Break it off in the lock And let's tear it down some more Oh, we're gonna bring This house down They're gonna blow the roof right off this joint Yeah, they're gonna knock it to the ground They're gonna get wild It's gonna get loud They're gonna be a pile of bricks And wood and stone Gonna have to dig us out. Ha, ha. This house down. Oh, we're gonna bring this house down. tonight happy hour all right y'all we'll see you on sunday night thanks again for coming and joining us i'm heidi newfield that's my compadre that right there matt king and uh we look forward to seeing y'all the next time we get to uh, uh be a little host over here at americana highways until then be safe god bless and we'll see you next time see you guys say good night again heidi good night again heidi good night gracie Thank God for Switzerland. Coffee it's shops. Still going. <laughs> I love it when we try to go off and we can't. We're still live.